I have to do. Thank you, Petra. Um, and the next one is uh, Pavel Petri, who will give uh, promising practices of RRI from Techmania. Thank you. Uh, good afternoon. My name is Pavel Petrole, and I would like to introduce uh, some examples of the best practice in the Czech Republic, the best scientific practice. Um, However, first of all, I would, like to, I would like to say a few words about the conference which took place in the Techmania Science Center in Pilsen in October 2014. Uh, yeah. despite, of the, despite of the fact that the definition of RI was introduced, I think, I'm sorry, yeah. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, despite of the fact that uh, the definition of RI was introduced, I think, in an appropriate way, uh, the stakeholders who took part in the discussion were a little confused. They asked uh, whether RI should be implemented into the processes or programs, uh, and uh, whether the responsibility should be the financial responsibility or the uh, whether uh, it should be the financial responsibility or scientific responsibility. Um, but at the end of the meeting, and I'm glad that they told that uh, we need to develop some RI tools and put them into the practice. For them, it's necessary to implement them. Um, yeah. uh, not, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, they told also that uh, we should implement the RI tools into the whole scientific process from the, be from the beginning of the challenges through programs and processes uh, to implementation of the results themselves. They also hoped that um, we should, uh, that RI could bring us less bureaucracy. This last point was a very important thing for them indeed. And now something completely different. I will start with the examples of the scientific practice. Uh, the first one, Speech Tech. Uh, the Speech Tech is the name of the company which collaborates with the main Czech TV broadcaster, Česká Televize, the Czech television, and also with the Department of Cybernetics at the University of uh, the West Bohemia. The main aims uh, of this project are to uh, develop the high uh, high quality voice recognition system and to create the closed captions uh, for deafness and hard of hearing people into the uh, live TV broadcasted programs in the Czech television. Uh, this project is uh, able to support our, our effort to face aging society and uh, uh, aging society and increasing number of hard of hearing people. The developed voice recognition system was also used for writing down the memories and speeches of the people who survived Holocaust or Shoah, if you want. Uh, I would like to say another thing about this project, and it is that uh, the students from the Department of Philosophy at the same university were involved in this project as the shadow speakers. Their task is to uh, modificate the utterance of the TV speakers into the uh, into the appropriate way, appropriate form for the voice recognition system, and create so-called nice sub, uh, nice close captions. Um, yeah, and uh, I would like to emphasize that there is a gender equality in the working team. The very important is also the feedback from the TV viewers and therefore there was set up uh, websites uh, where the TV viewers can provide their feedback, feedback and also find the information what they need. Uh, I would like to emphasize that there is a collaboration uh, among the University of West Bohemia, the uh, company Speech Tech, and also with the main Czech TV broadcaster, Česká television. And I think that if we want to uh, put the RI tools into the practice, uh, the, nest, the thing which we, re which we really need is the cooperation. Uh, next example, the second one is AG Info. Uh, this project started in 2000, 
2012. AG Info is a commercial subject which cooperates with the Crop Institute, Crop Research Institute and uh, Czech Technology Agency, and also with the users. Uh, there had been a wide, uh, there, there had been a widespread um, market research before the project was started. Uh, and this project focuses on the agriculture in order to restrict the using of the pesticides. The new developed know-how is able to consider the uh, economic efficiency of the, of the using of the pesticides and um, the impacts of the pesticides on the environment. Both of these figures, both of these elements are expressed into the monetary figures. I would like to say that um, this system also uses use, uh, the widespread database system. Uh, the company AG Info supports its, supports its customers with the lecturing, counseling, and consultations. Uh, and the environmental protection is a very important topic for media, and therefore the media are interested in AG Info. It is the eco-friendly project. Next one, RISTEP. Uh, the main goals of this project uh, are to create, uh, de de develop, evaluate, test, and put into the practice a new comprehensive method of the, uh, for the urban management and regional planning. Uh, the main viewpoints of this project, RISTEP, are an efficient utilization of the natural resources and uh, environmental protection. The advantages of the project are the ability to consider the specific condition in every area area and a suitable analysis of the, of the actual state of the renewable resources in the given locality. Uh, RESTEP is the example how to take an advantage of the inventions and research it's a for the optimization of the using of the renewable resources. It focuses on environmental and the financial aspects, and especially on the energy safety. So the project brings us new possibilities how to, uh, for the creating of the energetic conceptions. Next one is SOMAPRO. This project started in 2009. Uh, the, yeah, thank you. The main aim of the Sound Moravian program from distinguished, distinguished research is to create uh, research opportunities and to support scientists in the Sound Moravian region. The SOMAPRO is a regional grant project uh, which is able to, able to attract the researchers from abroad to, uh, to, make, their, to uh, make their research in the Sound Moravian region. Uh, this project is co-financed by Marie Curie Action, and it represents the original analogy of the Marie Curie Fellowship. The project shows how to use uh, the financial resources in an appropriate way, and what is hereby fruitful is the international science. And the last one is uh, the methodolo methodological portal at WebA. It was established as the main, sub main methodological support for teachers and also in order to uh, support the implementation of the national curriculum uh, into the schools. Its purpose was also to create an environment where the teachers could inspire each other and um, share their experience, mainly uh, about the topic how to teach. Uh, the portal provides yeah. The main cooperating organizations are pilot schools and, uh, and, other and other institutions directly managed by Ministry of Education and also non-government uh, non service providers. In this project, I think, is important education. Thank you very much for your attention.